guys, so for today's video, I am doing a really random Target haul. Now, I posted a picture of my shopping cart on Instagram, and I honestly didn't expect so many of you to ask for a haul, but because so many of you did, and it was a really random haul, just to say. And also, by the way, my words seem to be getting away from me today, so if I start stuttering, I don't know where my words are going. Anyway, um, yeah, so a ton of you guys asked, so I'm here doing it. It's random. So let's just dig in. Okay, so the first thing I got, super exciting guys, these are cotton rounds, just regular Target up brand co coffee, cotton rounds. And I use these things like crazy. I use them for everything from makeup removal to nail polish remover or removal, which is what I've been doing the most with those lately because I've been changing my color all the time. So the next thing I got is this Method All Purpose uh, natural surface cl cleaner, not cleanser, cleaner. I have been going through this stuff for, uh, dude, see guys, I'm losing all my words. I've been using this stuff for a very long time. I love it. The smell is super like pleasant and light. It's not too overwhelming. It cleans really well. To be honest, sometimes the glass cleaner, if you don't wash it up, like wipe it off all the way, you can leave some streaks, but I feel like that's probably most cleanser or cleaners and in general I'm obsessed with method I use their hand soap I use their spray cleaner I use their dishwashing soap and I just love the line so the next thing I got is a 50 piece goodie color correction bobby pin set um I don't know I lose all my bobby pins like crazy and obviously since I have lighter hair now I buy blonde colored bobby pins the next thing I got is this oh this is funny so Dan and I were in the toothbrush aisle and he was like, can I please pick the toothbrushes? I was like, go ahead, Dan, you pick the toothbrushes. And he picked this, like, does it do it in the thing? No. Ugh. Oh no. Oh no. Turn off. Okay, there we go. It's obviously a pulse toothbrush. Um, it's just like the cheapo version of those Sonicare ones. This was like $4 at Target. So yeah, we always buy little two packs, little couple packs. And I don't know, there's nothing much more exciting about tooth or than toothbrushes. Okay, the next thing, I grabbed these on a whim. I have no idea if they're good, but I used to buy kids like Z bars from the Cliff brand all the time. I love them, they're super young, yummy. To be honest, they feel like glorified candy bars because I don't think they're like healthy, but they're better than getting like I said, a candy bar. So this flavor is the peanut butter chocolate protein bar. So I'll try it out and I'll let you guys know like on Twitter or Instagram if I like it. Which, speaking of which, I'm gonna be doing some Twitter giveaways coming up pretty soon. So if you don't follow me on Twitter and you feel like following me and my random tweets, um, yeah, I'm gonna be doing some Twitter giveaways. So, all right, then I went a little bit candle crazy. I'm not gonna say I went fully candle crazy because I've definitely gone candle crazier than I went, but I just was like, you know what? I'm just gonna grab candles that I like. I tend to be a creature of habit, purchased from the same line, and I just grab smells that I like. So some of these, I've never purchased anything from these lines before, so it'll be interesting to see how they burn. So the first one is Philosophy by Pure Natural, Tangerine, and Olive Scent. This smells, I don't know, dude, like tangerine. More tangerine, I don't smell the olive, but it's definitely an interesting tangerine smell, so I'm guessing it's the olive that's making it interesting. But I don't smell the olive, I smell the tangerine. So super yummy smell. Randomly, there was another smell by this line. It literally smelled, and I'm not sure if it was the whole candle, because I didn't even want to smell other candles, but I like leaned in to smell it, and it smelled like someone had like taken their armpit on the packaging. It smelled so bad, and I brought it over to Dan, I was like, dude, does this smell like BO? And he was like, that is really horrible. Someone did not QC check that candle. So that was off topic. But anyways, the next scent is the Pineapple Bamboo Soy Candle by Bella Illum, Illume, and really pretty packaging. And yeah, same thing. This just smells like a really interesting pineapple scent. Super fruity, super beachy. Dan's favorite scents are definitely fruity, beachy scents, and I like those too, but like I had pulled one scent yesterday, actually randomly, it was the sea salt one, which I would have assumed he would have liked, but at the checkout he was like, please don't get that, that smells horrible. So I didn't get that one, but I like the scent. Um, okay, so this is another one by that Philosophy by Pure Natural candle line, and this is Lotus and Lemon Peel. And the only way I know to describe this is it smells like a spa. And I said that Dan, I was like, Dan, smell this. It smells like a spa. And he smelled it. 
And he was like, dude, that smells exactly like a spa. So I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's the lotus or the lemon peel, but that's the only way I know how to describe it. It smells like a spa and they don't have any like scent description on here, I don't think. So really good, pretty packaging. I like the blue glass. And yeah, is that all I got for candles? Let me see. Oh, no, 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 I have one more candle in here. And this is from the line, it doesn't say the line, but the, the scent is called Pomelo Lime, fragranced soy candle. And this one, it's, it's a like, mm, I don't know, it's limey. I don't really know how else to explain it. All of these are like fruity, kind of citrusy, very fresh scents. Um, I used to be really into warm scents until I had dogs. And now I notice that dog smell and cookies don't smell the greatest together. So I like fresh, citrusy, airy kind of scents. I don't know if that makes sense at all or if that description is accurate, but those are the scents I like now. So um, I decided I wanted a new mouthwash. Dan has a big Listerine mouthwash, like a huge one. I, like it looks like he got it from Costco. I don't even know where he got it from. But I wanted a smaller bottle and I wanted a different flavor. So I tr I got this one, I haven't tried it out yet. I didn't try any of this. I bought it all yesterday, but I kept it all in my dining room because so many of you guys asked for a haul. So I haven't touched any of it. Um, and this is by the brand Hello, which a lot of you guys said on Instagram, you love this. And this is pink grapefruit mint mouthwash. So I am super excited to try this because I'm such a like a sucker for like cuter stuff. And I did, I wanted like a cuter flavor type of mouthwash. So we'll see how I like this. I'll let you guys know. So the next thing I got is this Glide Oral-B Pro Health Comfort Plus Floss. And Dan just wanted more floss. I didn't even realize we had run out. Um, so, but I like this floss the best because I have big teeth, if you haven't noticed. Everyone loves to jokingly call me Donkey from Shrek. And my teeth are really close together. I actually had to have like four teeth pulled because my teeth are so big. They like all wouldn't fit in my mouth. So this Pro Glide one, it's kind of a plasticky floss. It's not like a stringy floss. And so this one is the most comfortable for me and I really like it. Um, okay, so then we got this Crest 3D White Fluoride Anti-Cavity Toothpaste with Illuminating Complex. A lot of people ask me how I get my teeth white, and it's kind of just like, I don't know how to word this, We kind of I kind of live like a teeth whitening lifestyle, meaning I drink all drinks through straws, like even if I'm drinking wine, I drink it through a straw. Um, occasionally I use white strips, I don't use them very often though, because since I don't eat really like stain type things, like things that are gonna stain my teeth. I don't drink things that are gonna stain my teeth. I don't need them that often. And more importantly, we pretty much always use whitening toothpaste. So I like the Crest line a lot, um, but this one we hadn't tried before, this Brilliance one. Dan was just like, ooh, this one is new, let's try it. So I was like, all right, that's fine. Works for me. The next thing I got is this Neutrogena Ultra Sheer Dry Touch Sunscreen in SPF 100. and. The reason why I got this, um, you guys know I have my laser done, so I wear laser all over, or I wear sunscreen all over my face, my chest, but I've recently started wearing like retinol and sunscreen on my shoulders, and I am now taking it down to my hands and my arms because I'm realizing I do live in sunny California and I'm so fair, and I just realized I'm like, I'm getting this laser done all over my face, and it just feels like if I'm gonna spend so much money later to correct something, which that I couldn't control. It was acne stuff. I did everything I could for it, but like sun exposure, you can control that. So I really want to start wearing SPF 100. And now that Dan is racing, we are going to be outside a lot more. I actually need to go buy some really big hats because like on Saturday we were out in the sun and we didn't even show up as early as him. So this is for him too, but we were out in the sun for like seven hours and I mean I was under shade a lot but still it's just a long time um so I've heard really good stuff about this helioplex Neutrogena sunscreen so we shall see I'll let you know if you like it I got this and Dan was like what is this for one day of use because it's so small um we'll find out how many uses we get out of this I don't know how much it spreads the very last thing that I got in my random Target haul is this mini string lights from Room Essentials. Now, I don't know, 
I feel they were like very out of them yesterday. This was like the only one they had left was the green. I really wanted to get like five things of lights. I wanted to get like white lights with the white string for inside my house because I keep them around my mirror. Um, I keep them in my living room. I keep them in, actually that's pretty much it, in my living room around my window and then around the mirror. So this will be good for other places. Um, like we have a plant in our house that has lights and then on our patio we keep Christmas lights, but they were all out of the white on white lights. So that's kind of a bummer. I think I'm gonna go to like Walmart see what their selection is like. But yeah, so that is the end of my Target haul. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Super duper random. I will see you all very soon all over the rest of the internet. I hope you're having a great day. And that's pretty much it, playa. See you later. Bye.